Hola amigos and welcome back to Back to the Future the game. My god, it's been I've been laying the old um the first episode play on for about maybe 2 weeks now. Yeah, because um I had to focus more on I had a final paper due today and I'm kind of caught up in like college work, so it's it's not easy. But now that I have finished with that or at least part of that um i thought i could use some free time to like upload start playing the second episode to this game uh last time i remembered i think marty was um marty was like vanishing like in the first movie with his hand and then we we're brought to the sequel which is this all right so I'm I'm kind of excited to know what happens next. This is really all new to me. I like I like it when new stuff like this happens because I really don't know what to expect. But um yeah, share this experience with me and we'll go through it. Remember to leave a like. It really helps a lot to know that you guys like my content and please subscribe if you wish to see more. All right? So with that said, let's get started. All right, would you like to see a notification Mario has a new goal? I think I said no. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I uh, said no to that one, but it still gave me it anyways. All right, Telltale Games, such great creators of decision-making games and point and click and such and such. <laughs> Yes, here we go. Saturday, June 13, 1931. Is this where we left off? Yep, episode two. Get tanning. All right. Lead choreographer, art director, Derek Sakai. Please don't hurt me, Derek Sakai, if I did not pronounce that right. Peter Tisaik. You know what? I'm just gonna shut up. <laughs> oh, there's the hand vanishing. Uh, uh, what's happening? I don't know. Unless uh, tomorrow's newspaper. Do you still have it? Yeah. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on. This isn't fair to you people. All right. Subtitles. Local accountant beaten. Left for dead. Local accountant Arthur McFly was severely beaten and left for dead on the steps of the Hill Valley Courthouse last night. Oh You're no! Kill my grandpa? Tannen's goons, no doubt. Probably in retaliation for Arthur answering that subpoena you delivered. What are we gonna do? I'm not sure what we can do. According to this, your grandfather was dumped on the doorsteps of the courthouse five minutes ago. Can I make anyone Dad's happy? Dad's picture is disappearing. That's a time stream catching up with your grandfather's fatal wounds. Which means your father will never be born. And neither will you. Unless... Oh no! Unless we go back in time, right Doc? That's the plan. When did you last see your grandfather? <laughs> Four o'clock, in the town square. Let's give him enough time to make his deposition. Right. We'll have to be careful not to run into ourselves. That shouldn't be a problem in your case. I mean, you were in jail. All right, let's get moving before the police find us. Freeze! Ah. Oh, they found us. <laughs> Step out of the car with your hands up. Oh, shit. What's the problem, officer? Get in the passenger side. What was that? What was what? Oh, shit. Crap! I heard something back there. I think you're mistaken, officer. Yes, I think you're greatly mistaken. It was probably a bug. Jimmy the Cricket. Possibly. Shit. Well, looks like I caught me a fugitive. Carl Sagan, the speakeasy arsonist. A legend speakeasy arsonist. Come on, get mind. Yes, yes, get in. Get in. What? What the heck kind of buggy is that? Stay back. It's a prototype still untested. I have to go I back around. God moment. damn it, Doc. Or suddenly take off without warning. 
That so? There it is again. I think the night air is playing tricks on you, officer. Oh, fuck. Wait, if he's what pushing... is it, some kind of foreign oh my God. German or something? Not at all. This is solid Stop moving. workmanship. Let me get the keys. Where are they? Now I'm sure something's back there. Yes, yes, give me the keys. Where are they? Like something out of Buck Rogers. A year from yes. now, everybody will be driving these huh. babies. Got these babies, now we gonna ride. All right. Oh shit. Jesus, I wouldn't officer. be surprised if oh there's my a promotion God. in this. You're getting to be a valuable commodity in Hill Valley. Can I find a tire iron and just, you know, I whack you the guy? I cooling off a few minutes till reinforcements get here. Oh I fuck! Mind, but the car may have other ideas. What was that? What was what? I'm like right in front of you. I heard something back there. I think you're mistaken, officer. What the fuck? Yo, wasn't like, wasn't I in front of him? I'd like to get a closer look at that getaway car. What's that? I was officer. pretty sure I was in front of him. Huh? I didn't hear All right, anything. Doc. Well, I'll see you later. Don't worry, Doc. Leave it all to me. Stop. Scotty Crockett. Save your grandfather. I'll be fine until you get back. You got it, Doc. All right, Doc. I'll see you then. Let's ride. Oh, going seventy, going eighty, going ninety. Oh, what was that? That was the future, baby. Oh. All right, good good intro to this episode. I think I might be able to enjoy it. The only question in my mind is, am I going to be running into myself? The ones who previously were going into this timeline? Artie's got to be in there somewhere, spilling his guts to the DA. There he is. All I got to do is get to him before... Mr. Crockett! Oh, shit. I was wondering if I could do a little follow-up interview with you about the plight of poor Mr. Sagan. My Hold sources on. indicate that Judge Brown will be setting him free tomorrow. I wouldn't bet on that. What's that? Nothing. Listen, can we talk later? I've really got to get to the courthouse right now. Really? Why? I got it. Okay. Wait, before you pick, I, need, I just need to get something straight. I pick Sonny Crockett, the name. But after that, they've been calling me Michael Corleen, and now she's back to Crockett. I mean, what the fuck? What's up with that? Really? All right. What did you ask me? Uh, why was I going over there? Uh, my grandpa needs me. My grandpa needs me as a character witness to get a fishing license. A fishing oh, license. Well then, carry on. And do put that vicious dog of yours on a leash, will you? We have laws about that sort of thing, you know. Sure, no problem. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sure, no problem. So, oh shit. Ah. I think I oh, need some. On yesterday, Marty, stop talking and get moving. No, I need. I need bad dog. No, I no, Einstein? no, no. Einstein, what is it, boy? Oh shit! Go away! Go away, boy! Well, I am completely Crap. screwed. Einstein. Oh no 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 run Is a squirrel I know? <laughs> Oh my god he's just watching me <laughs> You wanna play? Okay, let's play. Marty, why are you talking? Uh where am I gonna throw it? What do you want? Want the stick boy? Wanna chase it? Yeah, um Oh, this is cool. Uh go over there. Go get it, boy. Fly, Einstein. Where are you going, boy? You're killing me, Einie. Oh shit. Let's grab the stick. Okay, let's try this again. Yeah, so let's uh let's this time let's <gasps> Oh! I got it. Go get her, Einie. 
There we go. She's like in the corner. You. Get this mangy animal away from me. Oh, come on, Einstein. Get away from the nice lady. My shoes. <laughs> Einstein, no. Way to go, Einy. Now to get into that What is she doing with that? Before Tana's guys. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh. My oh, shit. Marty, you're fading. You're not getting a heart attack. Get your shit together. Who's this snob? Hey. Oh, God. Um, hey. According to my calculations, the rotary engine for a full-scale rocket drill requires 1.21 kilowatts of power. Can you check over my work to make sure? Are you all right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Lucky bastard, you didn't see Why? me fading. Uh, he needs advice. I have to brief him on what to say to the DEA. Are you the legal expert now? Come on, shouldn't we be getting on with our work? We're on a strict deadline, right? I don't think so. So is Arthur. Sure, but Arthur's on an even deader deadline. Why are you so suddenly concerned about Arthur? Because he's my pops. Oh, no. oh my god, what the hell is that? What's what? Who are you talking to? I'm talking to you. <laughs> this, is, this is hilarious. I'm talking to anyone. I was working on equations for my rocket drill. Uh, no, I mean after. Uh, never mind. Let's get going. <laughs> Follow me. Oh, jeez. I thought I'd never leave. At least now I have a clear shot to the courthouse. Finally, can I can I go inside the courthouse now? Hey, this Zane. I'm going to the courthouse. Fuck you, Zane. Yes. Okay, I didn't. How did? Okay. You gotta come with I was about me. to say. Look, you're in a lot of danger. What do you mean I'm in danger? No time to explain, Grand Artie. Grand Artie. He'll stay at the police station until. Artie McFly. Just the guy we're looking for. Hey, fellas. Hey. Run. Get him. Run. Oh shit. I did not hear it. Did he hit me with a spoon? Cue ball hit me Artie? with a spoon. Uh, you know, that's not uh, cool. Better pick up their trail before I start fading out again. And here we go again. This shady motherfucker, Zane. <laughs> 